Welcome to Excel in a minute. Now and then, we encounter Excel functions that are interesting to experiment with such as the let and x lookup. That's why in this lesson, using these two equations, we will try to create a dynamic equation that can work around a dataset with multiple criteria. The let function has three arguments. The name, value, and calculation. While xlookup has six arguments, the first three are required and the rest are optional. The required arguments are the lookup value, lookup array, and return array, and the optional ones are the if not found, match mode, and search mode. So, here we have a list of pairs of shoes. And we wish to find the price of a certain shoe based on the selected item, brand, and material used. Also, take note that these criteria are the key variables for our let and zlookup formula. Thus, we have the formula. Where the let equation has item, brand, and material as the variable name and cells B12, B13, and B14 as the value for each name respectively. And for the calculation, we have an x lookup equation having the variable names as the lookup value, the lookup arrays are a2 to a8, b2 to b8, and c2 to c8. And lastly, the return array d2 to d8, which contains the prices for each shoe. And that's it for another Excel experiment. Should you have questions or suggestions about this lesson, comment on it below. Thank you for your time. We hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more Excel in a minute. You may also check out the link below to download the presentation. We hope to see you in the next lesson.